know about you, but as a kid, I would always think about futuristic cars, cars that you can fly or go warp speed. Well, we've come one step closer with Oscar, Google's self-driving car, making it this week's Game Changer. If you haven't heard of Google's latest venture, they've been working on a self-driving car for a few years now. Google has implemented the technology into an environmentally friendly Toyota Prius, which would allow drivers to be hands-off through a combination of laser sensors, cameras, and satellites. The Google car seemed like a far off reality, but Google has been testing it on the open road and they have recently announced that they have logged over 300,000 miles of accident free travel. Now, there are a lot of questions about this car, specifically around pedestrian behavior and how the car would predict it and respond to it. Now, Google is working on some software to solve that problem, but the biggest problem that we have with this car is that it goes to speed limit. And I don't know about you, but I don't know anyone who goes to speed limit. Google has some prototypes that they're working on on a race course, and when pinned against another driver, human driver, well, the Google car wins. No matter what, these successful tests really change the automotive industry. While most industry officials will tell you that a self-driving car won't make it to the market until 2025, there are some features that we're seeing in this car that can make it into our current productions, such as a traffic jam assist or even adaptive cruise control that will help make cars safer for all drivers. For me, personally, I have a lot of mixed feelings about this. I mean, I'm excited to have hours of my life back where I can read, write, and be productive and get the things that I need done. You know, maybe even drink two coffees at the same time. However, I love the thrill that a yellow light seems to bring, or being in control when I have a long drive on the open road, and I'm really not sure if I want to give that up. But what do you think? Do you think that we're all going to be chauffeured around by our cars? Do you think that people will feel liberated because they'll have hours of their life back? Or do you feel that this is just one more thing that they won't have control of? I'd love to hear from you. You can reach out on Google+, Facebook, or on Twitter, where my handle is The Sun Queen. I'm Sinead Duane, and this is this week's Game Changer.